Hey guys, we are going on our weekly trail. Usually Gabby comes with Stormy Boy, but she's tired tonight, so she's not coming. It is the end of the day. It's the day, part of the day where it's so quiet and nice outside. And so that is when we like to ride. <laughs> I'm out of breath from catching my horse, but my horse is so used to going at night now that I stood in the field and said, come on, Pen, and she walked up to me. Um, so I don't think I've shown you guys our new setup here. We have two sets of cross ties for the horses. So Sophie and I can tack up together. As you can see, Sophie's already tacked up and Lady and, and Penny is not. So I'm gonna get tacked up really quick here and we're gonna take you guys out on our trail. I told Sophie that she could gallop today. Well, cause she's been really good. Like last lesson, she calmed down really fast after cantering. So like, yeah, I mean, she needs, she needs practice with cantering. You would love Lady Gallop. I know. So, but you're not to. I mean, they need to practice cantering. <laughs> Why are you licking my hand? Um, so, and Sophie loves to do it. Normally she just walks with me. I don't feel like Penny's at that stage anymore where she's gonna try and gallop off with me because the other horse is galloping. So I said, yeah, let's just do it. Your horse doesn't gallop, she, she slowly. Yeah, no, my horse, I love her canter. But anyway, let's get going. Look how nice Lady Mina. Yeah, she, she's wonderful in every way, and so are you. Look at the difference in size. How tall is she? Someone asked me, and I said 16 one. She's scared because I sprayed her ears. How tall is she? Like 16 one and a half, maybe. I don't know. 16 one and a half, maybe. She gets really good normally for the plastic. Can you spray my horse, too? Spray. I want to show them for them from the back. I like this comparison. Oh, all right. You just gotta not let her see it. Well, I start at the shoulder and she says, okay. But look at the difference in the size of them. See? Work it out, having two. No, because I can barely put my saddle on. Oh, you got this side first. All right, so these are the comparison shots. Penny, who's a big horse. She's not big. Okay. She is big. And then a lady who is a bigger horse. Like oh, that, it's a big butt. Look, she's got a heart-shaped butt. And then that's her butt. We are up. I'm on Penny. I wish I had my GoPro. Sophie's up on her dog. We got some chickens uh, up on her horse. Sorry. Um, Sam, you need to get the chickens. And we are going to head out. Sophie's going to try and lead. Pen Penny's tired out now. Like she's 18 now. <laughs> Lady's waiting for a chance to go. Penny's just like, I'll just stand here. I'm fine. I love it though. This is my favorite. Love being up here. Like, the view, man. The view is just amazing. I swear, this time, if she walks perfectly calm this time, I'm gonna be like, okay, so if I wanna gallop, we're gonna walk. But if I wanna walk, we're gonna gallop. Yeah, she likes to make her own rules. All right, we're gonna get going. All right, let's go. We're gonna see if Penny will stay behind. Love my saddle. Let's go. That's a girl. That's a girl, yeah. What a good pony. Oh, she's thinking about it. She's thinking about being in charge, being large and in charge. Yeah, walk slow, Pen. Don't trip, or I'm putting you guys away for a few minutes because I don't want any tripping going on. Come closer, dance for me. Easy tiger, easy, let your hair down Come closer, let me see All your million faces and all your million mistakes You don't need to hide Yeah, she's quiet and calm! Yeah! Penny's like... You keep going. Just wait. Penny's like, are we going home? Wait, I like to give her a treat every time we stop. It doesn't help when Storm's up there screeching and running and acting like an idiot. All right, well, you, you want me to go first? Well, go, because you're slow. All right, I'll go. We're slow, Pen. We're the slow team. It's official. Penny's the follower. She doesn't ha she's not happy about it, though. Slow down. Whoa. Good girl. She's been, she would be such a good barrel horse if she has to Hold on. Here. Oh, there you go, good girl. I like to treat her because she's one of those horses that responds. Okay, to 
treats and food. And I like a little slow. You don't have to go fast. There's Sophie up there. They're okay. Yeah, you stopped. Like, lady just wanted another horse, maybe. All right, now we're going home. Penny is trying to gallop away on me. Don't look over there. Just wait here. <laughs> this is scary. So I'm going to try and film this. <laughs> oh my gosh, Penny, it's okay. They are, oh, please don't fall. Look at them go. Sophie is in love with this horse. Like, what a fabulous girl. And Penny's being so good because she doesn't really want to stand here. She wants to get boogie and home. Good job! Are you going to go again? So we're just walking along. Sophie starts galloping. Maybe a heads up would be nice because Penny was cantering a little. And then all of a sudden, Penny's like, get off me right now! And starts trying to buck me off. She's tired of this waiting around for Sophie. Well, this was not the ride to video because somebody's horse acted up. She tried to buck me off twice in a row. Yeah, I know. You think you should have more treats, but you're not because... Anyway, she's mad at Lady because Lady galloped. It's the first time she galloped. And she... So we went first so that she didn't have to feel like Lady was anywhere near her. And then... She literally backed up and tried to kick Lady with me on her and Sophie on Lady. Yeah. So anyways, through it all, I stayed on because I wanted her to learn. But then it got to the point where she was like not having it anymore. She started to like do circles. And so anyways, I jumped off because I couldn't get her to go. Your horse tried to kick mine. <laughs> My horse tried to kick yours. It's because she... Your horse ran in front of her, like ran, galloped, and Penny thinks she's the boss. So she's mad. But I found it really easy to sit her box. Like she had head to the ground. Yeah, I screamed. But as I try not to, it's just instinct. I also had to spend the whole ride slowing her down. And I hate those kind of rides because Sometimes she hasn't been like that for this for like the last three weeks. She hasn't done that at all. She's been like so calm and just walking like she was at the beginning. I know life is hard when there's herd dynamics at play, huh? I still love you. Sophie just said that she can tell that Lady understands what she wants from her now, and that's so good. And that was like evident. Don't let her. She's scratching her face. Yeah, well, I don't know. Dad built this thing. You she never know. Anyways, I know the reason that late that this horse, this horse. <laughs> tried to uh, buck me was because oh see my girth was too loose. But um she was mad about the herd dynamics for sure. I was pulling on her face to make her slow down, which she doesn't usually really mind because we have the bitless and she does really good with that, but she was really good for a long time when I made her stand still. Like I was videoing Sophie and Sophie was galloping, but Sophie was far away. And then Sophie galloped really close and then Penny was like, it's on. And then from that moment on, Penny wanted to go. So I was having to pull back, pull back, pull back. I just was doing so many half halts and making her stop because she does really good when I make her stop. And Every time I let her go though, she was like, oh, come on, they're going, I'm the boss here, I'm going to. She was like, she was really mad about the whole lady thing. When we go together, everybody walks calm. Penny is great. Which my horse normally never does. Which my horse normally never does. Sophie's horse never does that. And she did it so beautifully. She was calm this whole ride. She can't, she galloped twice, three times? Twice? Twice and then like, so she galloped twice and calmed right down the minute Sophie stopped ga gallop, gallop, the minute Sophie stopped galloping she was calm except for when Penny was trying to race her like, yeah she was like all right let's go yeah that was not fun oh man Sophie says it's like math. It takes her three times of doing something before she's like, oh, okay, I get it. Sophie says it's like math. You don't understand it, you don't understand it, and then suddenly you understand it. It wasn't me. I don't understand it. 
<laughs> unless, unless it's soapy. <laughs> Who does not love math? Anyway, I still love Penny and I know what happened and I know that she didn't like me holding her back when she wanted to go. And uh, for most of the part, she did phenomenal. I'm not joking. She did so good. She sat there while Lady Galloped. It was only when Lady Galloped close by. Oh, you guys could, hopefully you guys could see that she, can you give me a carrot please? That she actually loved it. Did you love that ride? <laughs> She's like, no, I prefer being a lawn ornament. I just prefer sitting. So the best advice that we've gotten from a viewer, not the best advice, but something that, w that we didn't know, excuse me, something that we didn't know that a viewer told us that has really changed my, the way I do things is Margaret Porcolab told us once. Porcolab? Porcolab. Oh, I'm probably saying it wrong. Probably. Oh, these are frozen. Not really. Mine is. Anyways, she said that after you get on, like the saddle all on and stuff, and you're just about, everything's adjusted, and you're about to ride, do stretches and pull your leg, your horse's legs forward, because it, the, the girth can get pinched up there, pinch their skin. And if you stretch them... Girl, <laughs> she's, she's cut fish lips. I know, she does. She's got the sucky in kind of lips. Like, you put your hand close to there, she sucks anything that she can in. And Penny's polite when it comes to food. Everyone is far. <laughs> I know. I mean, I don't she think... She doesn't bite your fingers. She doesn't. You could put her your whole hand in her mouth and she would not bite you. That's the same with honey. I know, honey. She was a baby, I stuck my fingers in her mouth. And the same with the puppy. Oh, and my pig. I put my finger in the pig's mouth today and posted smell. Your pig might be at the gate at the fence when I got my horse. Oh, really? Yeah. Is she out of the stall? Out of her area? She was in the rock field. Oh. Anyway, I don't know how long this video will be. But I wanted to show you guys our ride this week. We usually ride on Sundays, but we can't ride on Sunday today, this week, because it's going to rain. And I honestly think that a lot of the problems I had with Penny were me trying to film. And that's, like, the big reason why Sam said, like, stop the filming and just go out and ride your horse. And you guys have said it for years, and it is exactly what I needed to do. Wow, she's tall. Let's see. So I can get their heads... Well, you can't tell. Anyway, that's it. I almost got bucked off. I actually like went forward in my saddle, but my sa Western saddles, you don't really get bucked off the way you do in an English saddle. Okay, English is easier. Really? Because Western, if you're falling off, you have to try and avoid a horn. But English, you can just let yourself fall. Well, I didn't want to let myself fall. I was happy. The horn literally stopped me. Like, my girth was a little looser than I'm used to. I don't know how that happened. Because she... Stop puffing out once you get on. I still love you. <laughs> yeah, I still love her. And I'll still ride again. The only reason I got off, I, I wanted to get off like five times. But Sophie's like, no, just stay on. Well, because so, when we were on trails before, and I was like, I'm getting off. You're like, no, you have to stay on. <laughs> I know. And I was going to stay on, but it got to the point where she was like, okay, I am so done this. I'm getting like. <laughs> Girl, I went under a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Sophie went under a tree. She said, Yep, Sophie almost got decapitated once you on a trail ride. Under that tree. Oh, you were fine. Bro, I was <laughs> not. I, I cannot lay fully on my horse's back. I did that day. Anyways, she wa I was going to get off long before I did. Sophie wouldn't let me. And then it just finally got to the point where she like backed into Lady. Hold on. I love you. I love you. Okay, move out of the way. Lady's coming through. Watch, she's going to go in the field and be mean to Lady now. Oh, you're lucky. I have one more treat. <laughs> wow! See, I told you. Get, go, go. <laughs> I'm kidding. Jeez Louise. Oh, Penny's in heat. Oh, that's why. I should have known. I even asked her when I was, when I was tacking. She's like, I'm not going out there. When I was tacking late Penny up, she was jumpy. Like, you know how you touch them and they get kind of jumpy? Uh-oh, let me out of here. Oh my God. Storm was sitting here with the babies, the little ponies, and he loves them and he was doing really good. But then Sophie said, look how good he is with the ponies. And then poof, he wasn't. Anyway, it was still so much fun. And I'll do it again in a second. And I got off on the way back. I think it was just better for me and for Penny. 
even though you guys won't think so. <laughs> Anyways, that's it. See you guys tomorrow. What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life. Deep connection.